Hi, Jim Urban here. Hey, this is 5232 South Jellison Street here in the Red Oak Development in Littleton, Colorado. This is absolutely a classic two-story townhome on the end unit. Come on side, check it out. You've got a phenomenal property here. Hey, there's a really nice front porch here as we go inside. There's 1,373 square feet plus 600 square feet in the finished basement. Once you walk in here, you've got a really nice fireplace right in your first view here. It's a wood-burning fireplace. And then you come over here and you can actually walk right into the formal dining room area. This whole thing kind of circles around. You come in here into the kitchen, which by the way, brand new cabinets in here with sile stone countertops. You can see that they're the solid surface countertops, real nice and solid, great for cooking and cutting, things like that. What you see here in this unit is what you get. You get the refrigerator, the dishwasher, the flat top stove, and oven, and microwave. Just around the corner from the kitchen, you do have a half bath on the main level with a solid surface counter. Convenient for guests. Heading upstairs, you'll see that there's closets and cabinets and drawers everywhere you go. Not to forget to mention that you do have a laundry chute right from the up, upper level here, which is nice. It goes right down into the basement where the laundry room is. And then you come right in here into the master bedroom, which is a large, huge master bedroom. And it does have its own bath with a makeup area, sink area, solid surface, countertop again, and tub, shower. This second bedroom is equivalent to the size of the master bedroom. So you could say that you have two master bedrooms up here. This one has a three-quarter bath with a solid surface countertop. The fantastic thing about this second bedroom is this built-in desk area where you can bring your chair up here. You've got some swing-out cabinets up here. You can have your office up here, your computer up here. And right to the right of this is a door that swings open into a little cubbyhole storage area. Heading down in here to the basement, it's nice and finished. You've got a nice family room down here and you have a built-in wet bar area. This is phenomenal because the refrigerator stays, it's already here, and we do call this a wet bar because it does have the sink. Heading on to the laundry, I want to show you that we've got a relatively new furnace and hot water heater. 2009 hot water heater, train furnace, all one. And just to our right here is the half bath down here in the basement. Very well decorated. And straight ahead is the laundry room. And what you see is what you get because the laundry room, washer and dryer do stay. Uh, again, more built-in cabinets here. Just everywhere you look, you've got cabinetry. Okay, here's one place where the man can have his man cave slash workshop area. This is it. The bench is here, it stays. Pegboards, ready to go. More cabinetry. Nice and big. And just out the back here, we've got a large patio area here. There's your air conditioning condenser unit. And the detached garage here. As I come into the garage, you can see a workbench stays. I just opened the garage door here. You can see outside. Not too often you can find a garage with a townhome, but this one's got it. Beautiful area. So come on out for only $199,900 this place can be yours. Now the owner, they just can't handle the stairs anymore, so they've moved on, the place is vacant, it's ready for occupancy immediately. 
Have a fantastic day.